Sheikh Tazalaks have been done a disservice for the last three days, kept in custody and lawfully so. But today we expect that sanity is going to prevail, is going to be released, and we're expecting a free pay because Tazalaks has stood shoulders above heads or heads above shoulders in the whole of Soweto. Nobody has, he has stood to stop a civil war that was imminent in the country. So today you cannot begin to come in with accusations that are frivolous, uh, that have got no legal standing for that particular matter. We expect nothing less than the release of Tantanax today. <coughs> we are hoping that when we go out of here, we shall be lifting him high on our shoulders and declaring victory over the forces of darkness. Uh, there's no threat here. Uh, we have been at, in front of the police station since Friday, singing and dancing, and people were just burning t-shirts of a party that they are now getting awakened, that it, that it is not formed to serve the interest of our people. A leader in Julius Malema that has chosen illegal foreigners over South African citizens. So the people, the mood is, 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 is high. People are looking forward to seeing Tantra walk out of uh, this court. And uh, they are disciplined. We are maintaining high morale, high discipline. And uh, there are discussions as to uh, whether the case must proceed or not. Uh, we must emphasize that uh, when the police went to fetch the complainant uh, on Saturday for a identification parade, the complainant was nowhere to be found, although he knew that the police would come and fetch him. So the identity parade did not happen. And we maintain that there is no case here because you cannot do housebreaking and damage the property when you are in the company of the police. This is a politically motivated arrest and incarceration. And we are calling for the release of Mtlantla lacks Lamini today. However, we have allowed the law to take its course. He has been incarcerated at Johannesburg Central Prison, whereas his case number is the Topsy V. To take his course. He has been incarcerated at Johannesburg Central Prison, whereas his case number is the Topsy V. So there are many things around this case that clearly indicate that some people are behind this. That the lax for housebreaking case that they claim was arrested by a provincial team of 30 police officers, 30 cars, an army of 30 cars with rifles. So it is very clear that there is a political, politically motivated uh, uh, arrest of a man. So we are here to now say that uh, he needs to be released. We hope that the prosecutors will follow the law and not the politics. Yes!